There are some men who think only to survive in war is enough, that they can live forever if they hold back in the battle. I say such men are cowards, and if they live, in the years to come they shall have no peace, though spears may have spared their miserable lives. They will be haunted by their own shame, aye, and by those who they failed when the day of blood came. If there are any such men here, I bid them leave this place, for we would not have them in our company. For the rest of you, grasp your linden wood shields and remember, remember the promises and boasts you made as we drank around our fires. For Odin will remember. The one-eyed raven lord sees all, and if your proud words were empty, then so too shall be your place at the bench in the Hall of the Slain. I mean, you, actually naked. Oh, not Starkers. Fun when I got into it, though. Ugh, you exhibitionist. What about all those leering men? Chill, Naz. I can handle myself. Can you handle hacking in? Like taking candy from a baby. Just code. breaking his security code. Not the most sophisticated system I've come across. Access granted. And we're in. Well, he's not hard up, that's for sure. Wow. Angel's Delight can't be raking in that kind of profit. Let's see where it's coming from. Now, look, a monthly deposit. The next instalment's due on Friday. I'd always fancied a nice walking holiday. Now, the wife and I are quite keen caravan tourers. Uh, freedom of the open road, where you like, when you like. We only ever go to the one campsite, but uh, that's another story. To be honest, uh, it's quite nice to get away from the wife occasionally, so it was a bit of luck when she went off to stay with her sister. As it turned out, I met up with a very nice crowd and we struck up quite the rapport, all putting along together, enjoying ourselves, uh, and a nice bit of banter with those two yanks. Uh, although, uh, to tell you the truth, I don't think they really understood the British sense of humour. You know, it's funny. I almost missed them all that morning, but uh, luckily for them, I tracked them all down to Malcolm's campsite in Patterdale before they set off. Now, here's a nice little tip for you. You want to try that muesli. It's quite nice. Just you wait. Harry, Barry, just you wait. Mm, mm, mm. Go check on the boy. Oh, and tighten his gag while you're there. Man, that was... That was intense. Peterson. Bravo, bravo. You know, you really stink of... Shut sh your mouth, thief. A gun! Welcome to the sunny banks of the River Star, my friends. Now, if you'll just give me the chalice and we'll be on our way. Jack? Why, thank you. Where's Colin? See for yourself. Behind me. Harry and Barry are taking good care of him. <laughs> Boys, the jet skis. The kid will ride with me. Let's go. Do, do something, Jack. My, you two look really cute there all alone. While you're here, perhaps you could try the romantic riverboat cruise. I would join you, but I've got a movie deal to clinch. Ta-ta, friends.